Warning, after watching today's video, you're gonna start to hear more yeses in your life. Yes, 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 yes. When you learn the art of getting people to yes, you access the abundance available to you. Yeah, you're gonna get more money and power. You're gonna yes your way to acceptance into that dream university. You're gonna yes your way into that dream job. You're gonna close more deals. You're gonna get a pay raise and a promotion. But most importantly, you're gonna yes your way to well-being and fulfillment. On the other side of yes is getting your needs met, getting the love that you're after and getting buy-in to the support of your ideas and your greatest passions. Now let me tell you the path to getting a no. First off, you're trying to force an outcome. You're coming from a place of scarcity and desperation, of neediness, and the other person can sniff it out from a mile away. The second way to get to no, you're trying to manipulate them to yes. So now I'm gonna give you the three reasons why people say yes to your requests. The first reason, because they feel moved and inspired from your authentic sharing. I was coming out of Starbucks and I saw this guy at a stand and he was raising money for Stand for the Silent. And he told me that the leading cause of suicide in a young age range is bullying. I was so moved and inspired, I was touched by it, that I gave him money right on the spot. I couldn't not contribute to that. The second reason people say yes, the person you're requesting feels connected to you and sees you as a leader. They respect you. The respect piece is cultivated by the way that you show up consistently. Who are you being? And the second piece of that is connection. People feel connected to you when they feel heard, they feel understood, and you show that you get who they are and what they care about. What if the person's a stranger? Well, yeah, you're gonna access that understanding of who they are and what they care about through your listening. Check out my video on powerful listening. And that brings me to the third and most powerful reason that people say yes. People say yes when they see your requests as an opportunity for them. And you can only frame a request in that way when you've come to an understanding of what matters to them and what they care about. What are their needs? And I wanna finish off with an example of what this looks like in sales. When I connect with a new customer and a new executive, I take the time to understand them. Who are they? What do they care about? What are their goals and their top challenges? I'm not forcing a sale on them because I want money in my pocket. I'm asking relevant questions and I'm coming to an understanding of their needs and desires, their goals, and I lead them down a path of self-discovery to understand and come to a conclusion on their own that Chris and his technology meets my needs and supports my goals better than the competition. That's how you get someone to yes. They are empowered with the knowledge to understand that you are there for them, you have their back, you have their best interest at heart, and they choose to say yes, and they feel that they enjoyed the process. When you show that guy or girl that you meet their needs and support their goals better, in the competition, you might just put a ring on it. What would your life look like if you could get more yeses? Guys, I want you to know that I've been listening to you this whole time, and I wanna invite you to subscribe and be a part of this community because you are shaping the future of this channel. So share comments on how I can improve what you're interested in, and subscribe, guys. We're building an incredible community together dedicated to personal progress and leaving this world a little better off than we found it. Love y'all. Peace.